to Eat Stuff with Brian Delkey. Hello everyone. So, another shot at uh, jerk chicken. Oh, I forgot I, I was still doing this, but I managed to catch it. Uh, today went to was it, uh, Caribbean home style cuisine. It's a place in Orleans about nine minutes away which some delivery apps think is too far for delivery. Uh, so I got the jerk chicken and as a side, they had an option of mac and cheese, so I thought I'd try that. Now this is interesting. Um, okay, so we have some kind of sauce without a lid. Interesting choice. Uh, looks like there's... There's a fair bit of chicken there, so that's nice to see. Um, this looks more like lasagna than mac and cheese, so we'll see how that turns out. And then there's some kind of slaw and looks like plantain. I'm gonna give this this mac and cheese a a try. I'm kind of scared now though with how this is presented. Yeah. I think some of the jerk sauce got in there, so that's a interesting taste. But as for the chicken, that is the primary concern. Uh, let me see if I can get a piece there. Touch mm, drier than the other places, but not horribly so. Uh, definitely. Fall, fall apart, like falls off the bone. That's good. Not much spice on, on here. You can get a little bit of it, but it's not very kind of mild. Oh, not, not that bad thus far. Okay, there's the heat. I think I just got a, a little section of uh, spice there. Ooh, yeah. Okay. So I will consume, and we'll see what the thought is after. Transition. And we're back. So, finished it up, and it actually wasn't too bad. The mac and cheese was, wasn't great, but I ate most of it, so very edible. The uh, chicken itself, uh, the, the first piece that was actually probably the driest bit, the rest of it wasn't that dry at all. Uh, it was pretty good. The, I guess my one criticism of it was that the spice seemed to be a bit inconsistent. You'd have, you know, take a bite of one, one bit of chicken and... There wouldn't be that much. Like, he had some flavor on there, but okay, it was was fine. Then you take another bite, and it's like, oh, my mouth is kind of on fire a bit right now. So that was a touch odd. Otherwise, still still pretty good chicken, and actually pretty good value considering the the other places. This place isn't that expensive, and you do get a lot of food for it. So I'll give it that. So yeah. Wasn't too bad, and I think this, uh, the sauce without the lid, I think this may have been jerk sauce or something, I don't know, it didn't, it didn't seem to change up the flavor palette much one way or the other with it, but it was still pretty, pretty not, pretty not too bad, as I struggled to find words. So that's it, we'll have one more place, I'll, I'll see if there's a place that the, because I know there's places like nearby. But the delivery apps say, oh no, that's too far, we can't put it. Fine, whatever. So I may need to go get something on my own, but we'll find one more place, we'll do the rankings, and then we'll go from there. So I hope everyone is doing well, and that you all have a good weekend.